Um, I knew I had the first place in me, but I kept get, getting boxed in, um, moving in and out of lane one. You know, I kept up to insert energy and keep pulling back. But it was a great race. I got my national record. We were standing for about 45 years. Um, I'm coming back for world championships because I hit the qualifying standard. I really can't complain. I'm just grateful and I'm glad that everything worked out. I was expecting it to. How long had that national record been a target of yours? Say that one more time. Please. How long had that national record been a target for you? Um, if I'm being honest with you, it's always something I had in the back of my head. But I was ready to equip with the skills to take it on whenever I got the opportunity. And today was really a great day to execute that. When did you when did you move up to the 800? Um, I moved up to the 800 fully, I'd say four years ago. But before that, I would be doing 1500. Um, I would be doing my 5Ks, my 8Ks, till I fully moved down to the 800. And any, any regrets or anything you wish you could have done different today? No regrets. I'm happy. I'm thankful because I'm going to get what I came for again in a few weeks here at the World Championships. Nice job. Thank you for the time. Appreciate it. Tell me about the glasses. Appreciate it. Tell me about the glasses. The glasses? Yeah. Whenever I wear these, uh -huh. it's just a totally different mindset. Really? Yeah. How, how so? Um, do my hardest workouts in these. Yeah. Um, and just, you know, whenever I put my glasses on, it's game time. Really? When, when did you start wearing them? Started, I've always been wearing my glasses, if I'm being honest. Yeah. But it was the first time, about two months ago, I got the courage to race in them. Because I thought I was ready. Really? Wow, okay. Great. Well, thank you so much. Congratulations. Appreciate you. Thanks. All right. Congratulations. Yes, thank